So I first started playing piano when I was about six or seven years old. I remember my great grandma gave my mum this really old piano, it was out of tune and it wasn't even able to be tuned. And um, I remember one time around Christmas we were watching Scrooge and I still don't know what song it was but it was the most beautiful piano song that I'd ever heard and I was like, I went to the piano at about five and I was playing this piece trying to work out what it was on the piano because I just thought like it was so, it was really beautiful. So then after that I decided to start playing piano. Um, and then when I was about 11 years old, I started playing flute and I did my grades quite quickly and I completed them um, by the time I was about 14 or 15 and then I was on to my diplomas. Um, and then I did my grade eight on piano when I was about 17 and then I decided to move on to my diplomas on piano as well. But because of uh, COVID, um, everything just kind of shut down. So I really got into yoga and mindfulness when I was about 14 or 15. Um, I found it like really, well, meditative um, and really found that the benefits were really helpful. And without really noticing it, I kind of put music to meditation. So I'd, it started like with making playlists about yoga for my yoga sessions to like help me, like it goes hand in hand. So it would help me um, to stay meditative and stay in the moment and not think about uh, future or going to school or thinking about my last day at school. It would just keep me right in the moment. And then eventually I read this book called The Power of Music by Elena Manns and it really just helped it slot all together because I understood from this book that it is literally scientifically proven that music helps you relax and helps you calm down and it really a certain instrument and a certain tempo will slow your heart rate, release endorphins, and it will just make you feel a hundred times better. So when I started going to college, when I was 16 or 17, I really started composing just for piano. I'd been comp composing, like, as I said, since I was about six, just sitting at the piano, coming up with my own ideas, but then I just, it really became my focus. My live performances, I started just going to open mic nights and doing piano covers and things when I was about 16 and then eventually I went to do like weddings and parties and private events and then last year before Covid I was playing in Barton Street Wine Bar which was a lovely wine bar in Bath, um, like regularly just sitting down and playing and it was just a great opportunity to be able to sit and improvise and work on different pieces. Um, and I also did some singing, which I don't do anymore, but <laughs> it was just, it was a lot of fun and I really loved it. And now that COVID has started opening up a little bit more, um, I've, I'm going to do a wellness retreat where I'm going to play a piano mindfulness set. And I will be working on an in-store launch in a candle shop in London in Shoreditch. So that's what's coming up in terms of my performances, as well as doing weddings and private events. During my first, well, during the first lockdown in March 2021, I decided to uh, really focus on writing a piano album called Piano Mindfulness, um, which has helped, which is important to, which I decided to do to help calm the mind, um, because especially in COVID, everyone seems is very very stressed. So I did this. I started composing in about January last year, and then I really tried to get it all together by the time it was June. So I recorded and produced it at home, um, on my piano at home, and then released it on all platforms, which was great. And the BBC Sounds have now released it quite a few times on their mindfulness mixes, which is, which is great because um, it really helps new people find my music and it really helps up the listens. I think uh, by now I've had about 350,000 listens on BBC Sounds and 125,000 listens on Spotify. So in the future, at the moment, I am composing to a new advert, which will be out in about May, I think. 
Um, and I'm really going down the composition for film. I'm also doing three other short films at the minute. Um, a horror, a documentary, and um, a sort of thriller sort of film. Um, and so I'm really loving that sort of things, as well as I've got a new piano album being released in June with a special piano mindfulness candle, uh, which will be released in the shop in Shoreditch, which I'm very excited about. Um, and I'm now a freelance composer for three or four places in New York, LA and London. So um, I do some work for them in terms of adverts and commercials and things like that. So it's so much fun. <laughs>